This is actually going over a lot easier than I thought it'd be. Oh, God. Ah, oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, ah. Oh. Fucking nerd. Bugging me right before the nuke's gonna land. Shit. Ooh! Hell yeah, that machine gun prime. Hold on to that. I'm collecting prime receivers. So the Gatling gun is actually super good. The two shot explosive Gatling gun, rather. Really, even with more people here. Since I'm doing this solo, um, this should... I failed last time I tried this, but I've got all my buffs. So, I should do a lot better this time, because she's not getting her buffs off of other people being here. Yeah, she's landing already. Hell yeah. I need to buff my shit. I don't even need, I don't even need psycho tat. Psycho buff. Got one good shot in there. Seems like direct hits. Um, fuck off. Seems like direct, direct hits. Um, on the queen with explosive weapons aren't effective. Oh my god. I shoot the ground right below her. I'm gonna do the psycho this time too. Yeah, you see that? Hit the ground right but uh, beneath her head. It's good. I need to remember also I'm, I'm using adrenaline, so that's a 60% damage bonus. For 30 seconds after I kill uh, something, so it's actually pretty convenient that I have a steady supply of assholes coming to me. Oh, fucker. This is actually going over a lot easier than I thought it'd be. Oh god! Ah 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 ah! Shit! <sighs> She's gonna be at max health again. But at least I know that I'm doing a fair amount of damage. Also got a prime receive. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Yeah, that's her. Oh my gosh, she's almost dead. What the fuck's going on? Somebody here? Just looked at the map. Nobody else is here. Oh, bullshit, bullshit. Well, I don't know what the hell happened there. She wasn't even mutated, I don't think. And then all of a sudden, she was almost dead. So, I think I'm gonna have to try this again. So, I'm gonna launch another nuke, and we're gonna try this again. Luckily, uh, I'm pretty much by myself. I think there's like one or two people on the map, but they're not gonna bother coming down here with so little people. They think that we're not even gonna kill the queen, but I was supposed to upload a video on 10 legendary farming methods today, but um, that actually is turning into 12 legendary methods. I'm gonna upload that on Sunday, hopefully Sunday. I'm putting a lot of work into that video, but yeah, let's uh, let's launch another nuke. And we are back. Oop. Seems like I uh, actually do about the same damage to regular Scorch Beast. So here's my shotgun perks. I turn all that on. Along with our uh, martial artists, rather. Let's me shoot faster. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna turn on all my shotgunny perks because that's my primary. I got a prime receiver on my combat shotgun, and that helps me do so much more damage. Along with adrenaline. On my other fail, when I was trying to go against the queen, um, I actually didn't have bloody mess turned on. Uh, I didn't have, um, she's already spawned in. I like this little spot that I'm standing. Anyways, yeah, I didn't have a lot of my perks turned on. I'm gonna go over the perks when I'm done fucking this queen up. As you can see, the 
Gatling gun does pretty good. God damn it. Hey, melee, if you directly hit a melee weapon and you're hovering above them, even with marsupial, you're going to kill yourself. Especially if it's direct hit. She's landing already. Hell yeah. Fucking psycho buff. Don't take off too quickly. Oh my god. She's basically like a regular Scorch Beast when you're solo. If there's anybody else here, she'd be tougher. I've done 2v1s with her. Um, I don't do quite that much damage. Not jumping high enough. Kinda sucks, I have to turn off all my uh, perks that give me the ability to use my uh, stamina, whatever it's called, AP. I think my cycle buffs still work and I should maybe pop some just in case. Got her mutated already. We're not that long into the fight or that far into the fight. Alright, rocket, motherfucker. Big gun. This is the two shot explosive Tesla rifle I want to show in a video. I'm going to make a video about this and show you guys all about this gun. I really like this gun. Uh, mainly because it doesn't break. But I am going to give it away. The giveaway is still on, by the way. Uh, just need to figure out a thing or two. Alright. There we go. Oh my god. Easy. That was so easy. I love this. I love this gun. I love this. Oh, that's good. Yeah, adrenaline really helps. Uh, remembering to use uh, bloody mess really helps. Even the like bloody mess gives you plus fifteen damage, or well, fifteen percent damage. That small buff makes such a big difference, a noticeable difference, especially going against the queen. So I want to show you what kind of damage my guns do. This is without all my buffs on. So uh, yeah, that's 900 damage. So as long as I turn all these perks on. Uh, martial arts doesn't make my gun stronger, just lets me fire my Gatling gun faster. But uh, yeah, so my shotgun perks tenderizer, that's uh, plus 7% damage. Uh, people are talking in the background, but I'm doing this live, so fuck it, whatever. Um, let's see, adrenaline, yep. So, Adrenaline gives you a 60% damage bonus for the first 30 seconds after killing something. And then uh, we have uh, Bloody Mess, which um, rank 3 gives you a 15% damage bonus. All these give you a 20% damage bonus, you know. Um, put them all together, that's 60%. Like I said, Martial Arts is just so I can uh, fire the Gatling gun faster. Which helps me deal more damage over time, of course. And I've got my rifleman perks. I don't know if this actually helps when it comes to shotgun, tank killer. Um, uh, but if I use my rifle, it's good. Nerd Rage. That's a 20% damage bonus when I'm below 20% health. Which I don't want to do solo. When you're going solo against Queen, you definitely got to spam. Uh, you know. Spam that. Stim pack button. I think I've gone over everything. 60% damage bonus. It's beautiful. And uh, I also have Adrenal Reaction, which gives me weapon damage. It gives you a lot of weapon damage. I want to say it almost doubles your weapon damage, uh, depending on how low your health is. Um, I let my health get pretty low, but when I'm doing solo against Queen, I'm not willing to go less than half health because she'll one-shot me. And uh, let me make sure... Yeah. Oh yeah, also Demolition Expert... Uh, yeah, you do 100% more damage with explosives, which really helps uh, the damage go up there. So, now we need to go kill some Mafkas. That will give me 60% more damage, along with uh, Tenderizer we won't be able to see, but I'll do some Psycho. I'm not even using a small weapons bobblehead, um, which would increase my damage on my shotgun. Anyways, yeah, these guys are usually all up in, in your shit. And now that I actually need him, of course he's gonna disappear. 
God damn it. We gotta fucking scorch piece. I better heal up a bit. Alright, let's see if I can look at my stats. Weapons. Oh yeah, there we go. 2450. Hell yeah. And a thousand damage with the gallon gun, which is cool. So that's maxed out. That's with Nerd Rage. Without Nerd Rage, it's somewhere around 2,000 damage with the shotgun, but yeah, pretty damn powerful build, I say so myself. But yeah, guys, that's it uh, when it comes to this video. I had the fails from the other day, and uh, yeah, you can see a little bit of that. Um, just make sure you buff up, and uh, I will be posting that uh, video showing the all the different legendary farming methods. I made a post about it that I would be uploading today, but uh, I want to do a good job on this video. And it is my first like actual good video that I'm going to be uploading. And uh, I kind of want to see what happens to this video since I didn't post in such a long time. Hopefully YouTube doesn't punish me so bad and I can get some views on this video, but I definitely don't want to test the waters with my legendary farming video. Let's see how this video does. But yeah, guys, that's it. Um, also, the giveaway is still happening. Don't you worry about that. Also, the other giveaway that I mentioned a very long time ago, I have a, I got the Power Armor Edition, and I've got a Pit Boy, um, the one that you assemble for Fallout 76. I got those two things I need to give out. Um, I'll do a giveaway somehow, some way, later on. Uh, I've never done a giveaway like that, so I gotta figure that still. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and as always, I will see you in the next video.